Okay, hello everyone. Welcome to the very last episode of Max Difficulty Oblivion. For this let's play. Uh, I maxed out my character using efficient leveling. Um, if you can s just have a look there, everything's maxed. And uh, I didn't max out all the um, all the skills, but you know, my everything's finished now. So I've done all the guilds. I've done. Well, I haven't done all the little little side quests, but I've done all the main stuff really. Um, probably with the exception of Marin's Razor, but never mind. So yeah, um, that's pretty much it for this let's play, except this very last video. And I wanted to end it on this uh, last quest because it's also the end of the main storyline. So without further ado, let's get into it. We should go to the Imperial City at once. Lead on. Follow me. Lead on, my friend. Right. Um, we are now going to go to the Imperial City. Uh, right. Where should I go? Where should I go first? He's going to want to go to the Temple of the One at some point. But for now, we need to go to the uh, Imperial Palace. Still with me? Yeah. Good. Um, oh, I feel sad because... He's gonna die soon. Spoilers, spoilers, sorry, he's gonna die soon. Um as I guess a Sean Bean does in everything, but uh Yeah, and Martin did not follow me, so that's that's a uh, great fun. For the Imperial Palace ah, here we are. Chancellor Akado is expecting you. Boris you your arrival in the capital. Very it's well. Boris, Let's guys. Peace. I kept him alive, and now it's him. That's awesome. Good to see you again. I told Martin that Mancar Cameron was no match for you. Okay. I'm glad it was you that put them down. My only regret is that I wasn't there with you. Who knew? If you keep there Boris was. alive, he actually plays a part in the end. Huh. That's sweet. I hope he stays alive after the end. But he probably won't survive what's about to happen. Welcome to the Imperial... Okay, we arrived at the Elder Council chamber. I must formally present Martin's claim to Chancellor Ocado. Yes. Oh, yes. Yes, indeed. I've been expecting you. The full council has already considered the matter of Martin's claim to the Imperial throne in detail. Okay. Martin Septim, on behalf of the Elder Council, I Chancellor accept your Ocado. claim to the Imperial Chancellor throne. We should Chancellor Ocado. The city is under attack. Oblivion gates have opened and Daedra are inside the walls. The guard is overwhelmed. Courage, soldier. We have an emperor again. Your Highness, what are your orders? Shall the guard fall back to the palace? No. If we let ourselves get besieged in the palace, we're doomed. We must get to the Temple of the One immediately. As you command, sire. Guards, form up and protect the emperor. To the Temple of the One. Cool. The Imperial City is under attack. Oblivion gates have opened all over the city and Daedra are pouring out. I must escort Martin. Right. I really should have saved this. Um, because Martin can die here, I think. Um, right. Okay, I'm really not going to have time. God, it's so loud. Hold on, hold on, there's too much going on here. Um, far too much going on. Um, right. Cool. Nice. What the hell happened to Boris? He's stuck. Boris is kind of stuck in some kind of, like, healing state. Anyway, do you know what? No, that's fine, yeah. That's crazy. Ah, oh, there he is. Come on. We have to protect Yeah. Yeah, we do. Right, so this quest is gonna involve a chase through the Imperial City until we get to Temple of the One. Now, I think I'm not sure, but I think Martin might just follow me. Um I'm not 100 percent on that though. So far, it doesn't look like he actually is doing that, so that's not too good. Um, 
But we'll see what happens. Right, I think I'm gonna have to abandon the weakness to uh, po uh, magic spell. Just on the grounds that I can't get off quick enough. Um, that's quite a shame, but never mind. Are they on my side? Yeah. They don't look like dangerous, so yeah, they're on my side. Okay, these guys are still not dead, which I don't like. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to use like all my poisons here. That's fine though. I don't mind too much, and I'm about to die. Uh, I actually thought this would be quite easy, to be honest. Um, I really didn't um, anticipate having trouble. But uh, yeah, I'm glad that it is somewhat of a bother. Um, if it had been too easy, I wouldn't have been happy with that, so you know. Right, he's been knocked over, and these poisons really aren't doing much. Okay, are you with me, Martin? Gonna quick save. I don't want him to get killed. I really should have created a potion, a uh, spell that like heals him. Right, where's he taking me to? Uh, the temple district. Ah, that's where we need to be actually. So yeah, that's pretty sweet. Uh, right, good. Let's see what happens here. Oblivion gates everywhere. I think, I don't know, but I think the enemies just keep coming here, so let's see what we can do. Right, it might be a better idea to just use multiple poisons. Okay, Meryn's Dagon is here. The barrier between Oblivion and Tamriel have been destroyed. Our only hope now is someone to defeat Meryn's Dagon and cast him back into Oblivion. Perhaps Martin will know what to do. Yeah, perhaps he will. Uh, let's get some cool screenshots here. But right, I should talk too late. Mayrun's Dagon is here. Lighting the dragon fires will no longer save us. The barriers that protected us from Oblivion are gone. Yeah, they are. Can we cut, cast him back into Oblivion? I don't see how. Mortal weapons may hurt him. But now that he is physically here in Tamriel, they have no power to actually destroy him. What about the Amulet of Kings? Wait, yes. The amulet was given to mortals by Akatosh. It contains his divine power. But how to use this power against Dagon? The amulet was not intended as a weapon. I have an idea, one last hope. I must reach the Dragonfires and the Temple of the One. But you said it was no use. You'll just have to trust me. I know now what I was born to do. But I'll need your help. I have to get past Mayrun's Dagon somehow. Um, I'll get you to the temple. And I'll do the rest. Lead on, my friend. Follow me. I'm with you. There's no way I'm leaving him here with all these guys about. Okay, let's go, Martin. Let's go now. Let's go. Just, just follow me. Just leave everything else and follow me. Mayrun's Dagon. Oh, that's not Mayrun's Dagon. He just tried to stamp on Martin. Well, he's not very nice, is he? Yeah, guys, big red guy, that's Mary's Dagon. Uh, the city's on fire. Everything's burning. And uh, these Oblivion gates. Um... Oh, okay, so I can't actually go in them. Well, I know I couldn't, but um... yeah. What the hell's the entrance to this thing? Oh, it's back that way. It would be, wouldn't it? Right where Mary's Dagon's standing. What the hell was that? Whoa! Oh, wait. Oh. Oh no. I really need to get Martin into that temple. Let's just go in here. Let's wait. Okay. Martin and I are inside the Temple of the One. I must get Martin to the Dragonflies. All hope is lost. Right. Okay. Um, right. So, I do what I Martin... Must do. I cannot stay to rebuild Tamriel. That task falls to others. Farewell. You've been a good friend in the short time that I've known you. But now I must go. The dragon, the dragon waits. waits. I don't want to ruin the moment, but that sounds like something out of the Hannibal series, but never mind. Oh, there's Merrin's Dagon, and he looks pissed. I wait. Martin is... 
Martin's a dragon now. And he's gonna fight Marin's Dagon. Oh, a good, a good shot there. Okay, and oh, oh, he hit him. Ah, oh, Marin's Dagon is kicking him, kicking him all over here. Oh, and Martin, yeah, go on, breathe him. Magical dragon. Yes, go on, right in the neck. Kick his ass, Martin. Kick his ass. Go on. Show him the power of Akatosh. Damn straight. Yeah, this is how we do it in my neighborhood. Nice one. Okay, Martin, well done. You've saved Tamriel, now we can turn back to normal again. Any second now. Sure hope you don't turn to stone and get stuck like that forever. Oh, and he did. Wouldn't you know it? The amulet is shattered. Dagon is defeated. With the dragon's blood and the amulet of kings, we have sealed the gates of oblivion forever. The last of the septims passes now into history. I go gladly. For I know my sacrifice is not in vain. I take my place with my father and my father's fathers. The third age has ended and a new age dawns. A one of bloody When the civil next war. Elder Scroll is written, you shall be its scribe. The shape of the future, the fate of the Empire. These things now belong to you. Oh, I got such a lump in my throat what there. Where's Martin? I must congratulate oh, wow. him. Mayrune's Dagon is defeated. Cast back into oblivion. We've won. Yeah, we did. High five. Martin's gone. What do you mean, gone? We saw the temple dome explode. The avatar of Akatosh appear. That was Martin? Yeah, it was. Uh, he shattered the amulet. The joined blood of kings and gods. The amulet of kings. The divine power of Akatosh. And Martin's blood too. Then Martin is gone. But the gates are sealed. Yes, sealed forever. Merun's Dagon and his ilk can never threaten Tamriel again. Martin I bet they can, is though. dead, but he died an emperor. And a hero to rival Tiber Septim. What about the Empire? This victory is not without cost. We've lost Martin Septim. What an emperor he might have made. His sacrifice was necessary, but it leaves the Empire without an emperor. Again? I don't know what happens now. There are troubled times ahead for the Empire. But now is not the time to well, worry you about haven't the future. had an emperor right Let's through this game, so... Let's just we're alive! Um, yeah, uh, Champion of Cyrodiil. In my capacity as Lord High Chancellor of the Elder Council, I hereby proclaim you Champion of Cyrodiil. And, as a small token of gratitude for your service to the Empire, I have ordered a suit of Imperial Dragon armor made for you. Nice. Uh, Imperial Dragon armor. Imperial Dragon armor is normally worn only by the Emperor himself, but you deserve no less, Champion. Nice. You have earned the highest rank possible in the Order of the Dragon, the illustrious Order of Imperial Knights founded by Tiber Septim himself. It is a high honor. Only six other champions have been awarded in the history of the Empire. Nice. Um, Martin. I know he's gone. As the Chancellor of the Elder Council, my concern now is how to choose. Yeah, okay. Um, so basically now I have to wait for a suit of Imperial Dragon Armor, which I'm going to do before, um, what you and Martin did before, uh, we finished today's video, so I'm gonna wait. I think I have to wait like a week or something. And uh, yeah, I'll show you guys what the dragon armor looks like. Okay guys, so this is what I was waiting for. I actually had to wait two weeks, not one week. Um, but now I just have to go to the Imperial City Prison apparently.
because Chancellor Ricardo has been locked up for corruption. No, I'm joking. Um, right, through here, through here, and this is the payoff. Um, so I'm just going to pick up all this. I received the Imperial Dragon Armor that Chancellor Ricardo has forged for me. So I'm just going to pick all this up. Um, apparently I have access to the Imperial Legion Armory now. So, what does this stuff do exactly? Let's put it all on. They all have some magic enchantments. Um, that's basically what the armor looks like. It's probably, well in fact, isn't anywhere near as good as my Daedric armor. Or is it? No, it's definitely not, because my Daedric armor smashed to bits. That's, uh, but yeah. It's probably the equivalent of steel armor, but it just looks a bit fancy. Um, but yeah, that's the payoff. So, um, yeah guys, this was the last Oblivion uh, Let's Play for this series. So I just want to finish by saying thank you to all of you that followed me. Thank you for all your comments, your likes and uh, hints and stuff like that. Uh, thank you to everyone who subscribed to me. It's been quite a long journey getting through this, max difficulty. It started off really hard. And uh, yeah, I actually managed to do it. And not only that, I managed to cap my character uh, with efficient leveling. So um, just a great big thank you to you guys. I'm really going to miss doing this Oblivion Let's Play, but I'll probably move on to um, Skyrim at some point as well. And I'm having a few issues with yes, Fallout 3, something to do with Windows Live games or something of that effect. But I hope to get that fixed and continue with Fallout 3 as soon as humanly possible. So, once again, thank you very much for following me through The Elder Scrolls for Oblivion Max Difficulty. See you later, guys.